This is Couples Court with the Cutlers. Mr. Shell, good day. How are you? Good day. Thank you, Your Honor. Mr. Shell, you <laughs> asked Ms. Turner, did you have sexual, physical contact with Mr. Huntsman when you stayed with him this past June? What was her response? She said no, Your Honor. What did the lie detector determine? The lie detector determined that she was being truthful. What are you feeling right now, Ms. Turner? I'm feeling hurt, but happy, because I had to come on court for you to believe me. I hate finish. That's just one test. That's uh, one else. Uh, okay, uh, uh, that's the main one, honestly. That ain't really... the main one. You're cheating anyway. That's... Okay, okay. okay. Hold on. Your, your... Mr. Shull, you asked Ms. Turner, other than the one man you've admitted to Mr. Washington, have you had sexual intercourse with any other man since your relationship with Mr. Washington began? What was her response to that question? She said no. What did the lie detector determine? The lie detector determined that she was being... The lie detector determined that she was being truthful, Your Honor. Yeah. It still don't explain the text messages. It still don't explain uh, you not answer the phone, which is supposed to answer the phone. Well, actually, everything she said has been true. And, and maybe, Mr. Washington, the issue is you and not her. Do you want this relationship to work or not? Yeah, I want, I want my morning woman. Well, don't let your insecurities be your kryptonite. Oh, repeat it. <laughs> repeat oh, it, look your at this. Give me some. Oh, oh, honey. Honey. <laughs> look at him. You see that? <laughs> What's y'all talking about now? <laughs> right. now All right, Ms. Mr. Turner. Cutler. Yes, Your Honor. Do you have anything you want to say to Mr. Washington? I do love this man. He is my Superman. You've been there for me and my son, which is the biggest gift and blessing that I could ever think about. And my thing is, is that I need you to trust me. I need you to be my Superman. Arthur, Jermaine, Washington. <laughs> Will you marry me? Wow. 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 This is, uh... This... This... Yeah, it's deep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you don't find too many women asking men to marry you, and I ain't... I ain't expect this. I'll marry you a thousand times. Well, Mr. Cutler, I would say our work is done <laughs> our here. Our work is done. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah. This is a first. This first. Yeah. Uh, Ms. Turner, that's how you get this job done. <laughs> <laughs> that's how you do it. Yeah. I feel like a woman now, like, look, look, I got a ring. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, good, bro, I apologize. I'll see you, bro, bro. My bad. That's how you the best man now? You know? Who wants to be the best man? I got you. Uh, as long, long as the bachelor party be off the hook, <laughs> bro. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Lucky, don't do nothing to have him back in my courtroom, man. <laughs> so what do you want to prove? That I'm not cheating and that what she says is false. And uh, I think that whoever she was with in the past may have ruined the way of her. You know, our relationship. Is lying and I want my me. fair chance. His lying is what uh, ruined uh, it. Okay, so you're not just paranoid. No, I'm not just paranoid. He just thinks he's slick. He's a charmer. <laughs> just last <laughs> night, he asked my father for my hand in marriage. Oh. And I'm not doing anything until I find out for sure. All right, I wait, need to wait, know. wait, wait. The day before you come to couples court. Yes. Yes. Mr. Manriquez asked you to marry him. Yes, ma'am. He's I already did. asked me. Oh, ask your my father. father. Oh, he went my... big. He yes. went old school. Yes. <laughs> what did her daddy say? Uh, he he said that he has my blessing. He wouldn't be uh, more proud of having a better son-in-law than than me. And we have uh, his blessings. Mm. 
Mm-mm. Really? All right, you heard that statistic. You sticking with your story? Yes, ma'am. All right. Mr. Manriquez was asked a series of questions. The first question was, during your nine-month relationship with Miss Aladul, have you had sexual contact with anyone you met on the internet? What was Mr. Manriquez's response to that question? He said no. What did the lie detector determine? What did the lie detector determine? The lie detector determined he was truthful. <laughs> well, well. I'm glad to hear that, but I want to hear the next question. Mm-hmm. So you still don't believe him? <laughs> Not yet. All right. All right. So you asked him, during your nine-month relationship, have you had sexual intercourse with anyone other than your girlfriend, Miss Adul? What was his response to that question? He said no. What did the lie detector reveal? The lie detector revealed he was true. Oh, my God. Miss <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Oladul, you hear that side? Did you hear <laughs> we, we heard a heavy, heavy sigh of relief accompanied with a smile. I didn't want him to be lying to me. I didn't want him to be cheating on me. I love him. And really, deep down, you probably did not want to cover up that tattoo, did you? No. Okay. (laughs) Of course not. That's why I got it. All right. So, is it okay if the court uh, dismisses your claim for the tattoo removal? Yes, Your Honor. So, we're going to dismiss that claim at this time. (laughs) Now, Ms. Aladul, if I remember correctly, there's a question on the table from last night. Do you want some time to answer that question, or are you prepared to answer it now? I'm prepared to answer it. Yes, I will marry him. I've Woo! always him. <laughs> <laughs> <Aww>. <laughs> All right, we want an invitation. And I hope to God, best friend, that you were right. being a best friend. Mm-hmm. That there has to be a good reason. Damn good. For them to be together. Absolutely. Especially if she's not around so and she doesn't sorry. know about it. Yes. All right. Ms. Gunn? Yes, sir. Is there a good reason why you and Mr. Elliott have been spending so much time together? There is a very good reason for it. We've been planning something, and honestly, it's it's, it's kind of a a hard shell because this wasn't the plan. Just put it out there, please. Look, um, this this is what I wanted to say right here. I was T-Bone in a motorcycle wreck. This woman right here, to care of me. I do everything a man's supposed to do. But that really doesn't answer the court's question. The question is, why are you spending so much time with your girlfriend's best friend? What this is that? Right here. That's why. And we had a big plan. We That's were planning a nice an friend. engagement for her. Wow. Oh. oh. <laughs> but she's always thinking something's going on. Is that a damn good reason? That's a, that's a, that is a damn good reason. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Those are different kind of tears. Where's the cinder block now? Is it gone? It's gone. <laughs> All right, what you got to say? For, first, I do apologize to both of you very much, and I love both of you so much. Um, second, um, I guess one reason why I, I am so, you know, like that with him is because that's the best man I ever had. I've never had somebody be as good to me as he has, and... Every man that I've been with has done me wrong in some kind of way. Congratulations. Thank you. Ms. Elliott, would you like to make it a moment right now? Yes. Yes. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. It won't be any proposal out there in the world like this one. Oh, gosh. Leanna Roden, she married me? Yes. 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 